All right, so quick video, uh, nothing too technical or anything, just uh, something, you know, switching out some shocks here. Another one of those wall, uh, we got the truck in the air, you got the tires off, all that kind of stuff. Um, this is just a, something quick, easy to do. So ran down to O'Reilly's, got these Monroe shocks. I do uh, like, let me already crack them open. Um, I do like though. Fish one of these suckers up out of here. So I do like that they are this nice, uh, nice blue color that kind of goes along with the truck. So, uh, so that's nice. I like that. But anyway, the shocks around here are old. This is just gonna be a quick video of uh, swap, swapping out the shocks. Just sit down real quick and get these out. And you can see these old red ones that look rusty and nasty. Um, they actually don't seem like completely blown out or anything, but. I just don't figure why we're here. So uh, I already busted that top nut loose. We're gonna do that. And you can see down here, there's a bolt on the bottom. Uh, so that's what we gotta do on the front ones. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that. Uh, just take those bolts out, um, pull these suckers out and put the new ones in. We'll be all set to go for the front. So I'm gonna get to work on that. And so here's the second one. Tightening up that bottom bolt. These things are a bit of a pain to get in. But anyway, that one's really close to done. You just gotta get that top one and we'll be all set. So the front's done. Now we're moving to the back. So here's what the back looks like. Um, got the bolts up there for that one. Down here, getting set to go. So go ahead and bust these loose. I gotta find the wrench for the other side of that. And then, uh, Get the tops out and we'll get these swapped out too. Oh, there it is. Um, got this in, sorry, I'm trying to wiggle to get a better view. So there's the bottom. I actually like the blue against the rust. There's the top. So that one's in. The one on this side's in as well. So those things uh, are all done. So I would say quick and easy. Um, but there's a fair amount of struggling, some rusty bolts, breaker bars, but we got it done. Um, no bolts broke or didn't cross thread anything, so worked out good. Thought I'd just show you this. Um, so we got these all out. Obviously, we replaced the uh, these old crusty ones here with what came out of those boxes. Now, if you'll notice, these are really short. We got them out. And you can crush them down pretty easy. They're fully compressed and they don't expand. They're just there. Um, let's see what the back ones do. I'm guessing they probably do close to the same. So I'm gonna compress it down all the way. And then I'll set it down there for you. Look at that. You can see the difference. No expansion whatsoever. So I'm glad we changed them out. They weren't necessarily uh they look like crap, but other than that, I mean, there's no real visual sign. The truck didn't seem super bouncy when we drove it, but still, they were providing next to no uh, support. Anyway, that's it. Nice new uh, Monroe shocks. Replace those old crusty things, and uh, now we hopefully will have a better ride.